Hello, welcome back. Hi there. So, I've done some things. Did you did you win the the um, slot games? No, fuck that. That takes way too long. You said you were gonna do that during your grinding I session. I tried. <laughs> I I'm too impatient for that shit. Mm. So, but I did do this. Mr. Kingsman's not a Nitto King. <laughs> oh my lord. <laughs> He's a big boy. He's a big old boy. Yeah. Um, I literally went back to a different town and I grinded the shit out of him. And uh, so now Mr. Kingsman is a big old boy and is ready to fuck some shit up. Uh, he learned Thrash and Horn Attack and Double Kick through his endeavors, and he also got Poison Sting, which is the only poison move he can learn, besides Toxic. So, yay. And then I was going to level up Sparky, but I said fuck it, so. <laughs> so now, the next step is to go and fight Team Rocket. And I warn you, this might be an endeavor. Because... Oh yeah, there's a lot of them. Yeah, there's a lot of them. And on top of that, so we fought this guy. Yeah, he's just hanging out. He's not trying yeah. to stop you so anymore. So I need the key to open that door over there. So I literally have to just go around and find my bearings. Oh my god, this hurts my eyes. There we go. Oh! You broke into our operation! Sorry. Sorry. My, I, I immediately went into, like, zoned mono vision for a second there. <laughs> zoned was, mono vision. And I was just like, wow, that guy's really tiny. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so watch this. Level 20 Eradicate versus Mr. King, okay? He's still not even the highest level. Okay. But I have Thrash. <clears throat> okay. And... It you just have that reticate on his horn. Just like... Yep. <laughs> Dead. <laughs> uh, he's also going to use another reticate. No, I'm not. Because since I use Thrash once, it keeps going. <laughs> so I don't have to use it again. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and that counts as one use. <laughs> <laughs> That's too much, man. Yep. Yep. Thrash is one of the strongest uh, moves in the game, but after you use it a third time, I think it confuses you. I mean, it does a shit ton of damage, though. Yes, it does. I think its base powers in this game, like, 80, which is pretty high. Oh, I found an escape rope. That'll come in handy for whenever I need to escape. <laughs> uh, I got myself with that one. All right, cool. Next floor. Oh, there's another guy. No, not the tiles! Not the tile. All oh, right, those are the tiles that send you flying in any direction, right? Yep. Ah, uh, boss said you can see ghosts with the sylph scope. That's what I'm trying to get, is the scope, so that I can go back to Lavender Town and see the ghost Pokemon there. Because uh, Team Rocket is also in that tower. That's a lot of Pokemans. So, um, uh, they have a Zilscope? They should have one here, yes. Oh. Do, 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 Thrash. do, do, do. Make quick work of him. Uh, yeah. Make him all, all the dead and stuff. About to use coughing. What I love about Mr. Kingman is he's also poisoned, so they can't, like, hit him with poison moves and it'll affect him. So he's literally just going to tear through most of the people they send out at me. That's one reason why I trained him up. And this is honestly giving him more experience. So. Uh, I, yeah, truly. And he's taking no damage, jeez. Nope. Because I'm going first, because I'm faster. Oh my god. <laughs> yep. This is why I trained him. Bow, bow, meow, meow, meow. Nope. I'm still thrashing about. Oh my god. <laughs> this is why I wanted an Inno King! That's why I was so upset when King Horny died. Oh, and Eradicate. He will not make it. He's too slow. Oh! Oh, it didn't confuse me. I guess those would be uh, regular games. I'll use Double Kick. 
Oh, I'm confused now. <laughs> <laughs> I still use double kick. I win. That's super effective. <laughs> God. Mr. Kingman is gonna be our uh, fighting Pokemon until I get a new, a new fighting Pokemon. God, Mr. Kingman, like you using Mr. Kingman is tantamount to the kind of ass beating we gave Peach and Bowser for in our real? Super Mario Party oh, game. Yeah, right? no, I specifically wanted this Pokemon for this reason. Uh, before I go this way, let's see what's further down because I can't remember. Oh, uh, 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 you've been I've, seen. Uh, I've been seen. <gasps> what's he say, Wesley? We got word from upstairs that you. Uh, we're coming. So what you're saying is, you're trying to stop me. I guess that means I'll have to murder your Pokemon. Oh, Machop. I didn't know they had Machop on them. They usually have poison Pokemon. Uh, Thrash? <laughs> Give him a good thrashing. That'll be fine. <laughs> this is just sad. <laughs> There's nothing they can do against me. About to use Machop? Nope. <laughs> you haven't had to change out Pokemon at all. Nope. I don't, pl I don't plan on it until I have to. Jeez. What what I find extra special funny is after the after you beat Team Rocket members, like, you're just a 10-year-old kid. What's to stop them from, like, gaining up on you and apprehending you right then and there? My Pokemon? Would you want to go up against that thing? Or my Gyarados? <laughs> but what if what if they tied your hands back and you couldn't pull them out? Like, like, you're done fighting, you're like, okay, cool, come so back, Nidoking. It has been proven in multiple uh, stories from Pokemon that Pokemon can break free from their own Pokeballs. Oh, that's true. So, technically, if my Pokemon really like me, they could break free on their own and s go and murder these motherfuckers. <laughs> oh no, more tiles! Do it! Hang on, I gotta see what's over here first. Nothing. All right, here we go. Um, let's see what's back. This here. is some intense music right here. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we're gonna go down. Oh, that hurts my eyes. Okay, cool. No. Oh, okay, cool. I found a rare candy. Ba da ba ba. What should I use the rare candy on though? <laughs> the Nido King probably. <laughs> Make him go up another level. <laughs> So he needs that much experience to level up. Yeah, he just leveled up, so. Oh, what's TM10? Double, Double edge. edge. That's actually a good move. Who would you teach it to, though? Someone with a shit ton of health. And I don't have that Pokemon yet. <laughs> Mr. Kingman, you now stronger. How you feel? Stronger? Good. <laughs> I have to go up now. Okay, so Woo! that means I'm gonna have to go left. I have to go down. And then that's gonna lead me. Uh, I should have to go through this one. I'll take you down. So now you'll be fighting against another Team Rocket member. That's fine. I mean, yeah! Get on, asshole! It's fine because you kill them. Stop meddling in Team Rocket's affairs! Um, but aren't you evil? I mean, you are <laughs> holding a whip in public. You, no, no, you go up to him, he says that, and you just put your hands on your hip like, Aren't you evil? <laughs> <laughs> You're like the sassy head tilt. <laughs> Team Rocket members like, oh, you're right, let's fight. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you're right, let's fight. Kicked his ass with double kick. Double kicked his ass. Ha 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 I've been very punny today, I'm sorry. Yeah, stop. <laughs> yeah, I, sent a, I sent a message to my friend earlier uh, saying, uh, oh shit, what was it? It was, uh, uh, I ate a bunch of uh, Scrabble tiles. Uh, my next trip to the bathroom might spell disaster. It's funny because I've heard that a bunch. <laughs> but it's so good. You're you're like you're not the first one to come up with that. Of course not. Of course not. I I, I found a thing that said it. <laughs> and it's hilarious. I love I love puns.
I'm gonna well, see if I can find puns from a certain era. From a certain era? Yeah, what- pick an era. That is a psychic Pokemon, I am not dealing with that shit. Since you're the punny man, pick a- pick a decade for me to search for puns from. 90s! I'm a 90s kid, of course I'm gonna pick 90s. Alright. 90s puns. Oh lord. Fifty phrases from the nineties that we need to bring back in twenty sixteen. That's an old one. Twin Oh man. I'm also a nineties kid, so. Um uh tch -tch -tch. let me see, let me see. I hate this. I instantly hate it. Why do you instantly hate it? It has it's gotta be better than you think it is. Um What does Sonic the Hedgehog wear when he goes to the beach? Just his shoes. A Speedo. Damn it, that's good. <laughs> you actually think that's good? Wow. Yes. Any um, pun, all puns are good. They hurt at a level that's just... It just is good. I guess. Um, uh... Oh, read this for me. Silphscope. The machine, the boss stole, it's here somewhere. Okay, so that means the boss has it. Cool. Awesome. I'm glad Thanks. I'm here. Thanks, asshole. Appreciate it. Can Going you believe that footage of polar bear drinking water? It's obviously fake. Everybody knows they only drink Coca-Cola. That's pretty horrible. Yeah. I actually don't like that one because it's not punny. The elevator doesn't work. Who has the lift key? I bet you have the lift key. What's a 90s kid's favorite soup made of? I don't know. Birkenstock. Ah! Which Spice Girl can hold the most gasoline? I don't know. I'm not reading that. <laughs> it's probably bad then. <laughs> Mr. Kingman uses thrash. What do you call a grunge garden gardener? It survived the thrash. It did one damage to me. Answer yes? the question. What, what do you call a grunge gardener? A grunge gardener? Mm-hmm. A grungy? I don't know. Hedgy. Ha! <laughs> I knew that you would like that. <laughs> Woo! That's funny. That's a good one. A Zubat? Zubat can... What do 90s boy bands and blue spruce trees have in common? They all have frosted tips. <laughs> You're so easy. <laughs> oh, it's so good though. Um I knew it. You had the lift key. What's a sure sign that you aren't Y2K ready? You backed up your uh, desktop by pushing it against the wall. Wow! Ooh, TM2. What's that do? Item. <laughs> Why did da David Hasselhoff change his name to the Hoff? Because he couldn't be bothered with the hassle. Oh. Let me know I'm not saying these for the audience. I'm saying these for him. Oh, <laughs> man. Oh, that's good. What does Michael Jordan like to put on his toast for breakfast? Space Jam. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Uh, I found an HP up. I better use it. Uh, HP up on... Uh, Mr. Kingman. Get some extra HP, buddy. Okay, <laughs> lift key. Do you know the worst part of finding yourself? Realizing you're not Waldo. <laughs> Oh my god, these are actually good! Yeah, of course they are! What happened when the 90s kids saw a disposable camera? It gave them a flashback. What did the 90s kids say to their classmates who stole their last Microsoft Office download? What? I'm coming after you. You have my word. <laughs> oh my god! Um... Uh... What gift is perfect for someone who likes a little PDA? A Palm Pilot. <laughs> <laughs> oh my 
my gosh. That's a pun I do on the regular, actually. Anytime I don't have a notepad and I'm writing something, I write it on my hand. And I'll look at someone, oh, don't worry, I got my Palm Pilot. <sighs> How do you know only 90s kids will get this joke? I emailed it to their AOL accounts. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Okay, pick another decade. Another decade? Yeah. This time I'm going for jokes, not just puns. Do you want to stay with 90s jokes or go to another decade? Uh, well, we should probably end the video first. Oh, that's right. Thank you for watching. I sincerely hope that you enjoyed the video. Um, uh, that you are staying safe and having a great day. Next time, more of this! Indeed. More eye bleeding tiles. Yeah, for real. My eyeball hurt. Yeah, so <laughs> thank you for watching. See you then. Goodbye. Bye bye.